come and close your eyes and start to focus into your breath. Taking some long, slow, deep breaths in and out. Allowing your body to relax, letting go of anything that's happened in your world for you today, any busyness, any stress. It's a very difficult time for many at the moment. So really just allowing yourself and honoring yourself for any stress or fear or anxiety, worry about the uncertainty and the instability of the world at this time. Just allowing yourself to be exactly as you are, feeling that you can show up tonight for this healing meditation exactly as you are. Deep breaths. So this meditation tonight, we're working with the crystal planetary grid. You don't have to have crystals with you, but if you have any in your home, just send your energy out to them now. They don't have to even be near you. They will feel you drawing their energy to you now, wherever they are in your home, whether they're nearby or far. We're going to use that crystalline energy to help to bring much needed light onto the planet. Activating and anchoring in this crystalline planetary grid, which is being really strengthened and intensified for us at this time to help us to finally start to unveil and release the darker energies that have existed on our planet for too long now, for many, many eons. Their grip has been tightening for centuries and we're now asking the light beings, the star people, the angels, the archangels, the Ascended Masters and the many councils of light in our galaxies and the galaxies beyond to help us to activate this grid to ensure the healing and the transformation of our planet. Deep breaths in and out. We're moving into a new vibration. We're moving into a higher frequency. And we're moving back into a time before time. And we're moving forwards into a time of love. knowing that time is a human construct that does not really exist. As we fly through dimensions and through this universe. This is a time for remembering and for reawakening for all humanity. So place your hands on your heart now. Perhaps your left hand and then your right hand on top. And tune in to your heart energy. Tune in to your heart. Deep breaths in and out. Feel your heart chakra and feel the rise and fall of your deep conscious breath. Feel our collective here this evening 
And whenever you're watching this, tune in, feel our tribe. We are many as we gather here. We're going to make a grid of light, a web, a mandala, a connection of healing light together. And calling that light in now, calling in the purest, most beautiful healing light from the heavens, from the angelic realms. And Annabelle and I are just gonna pause for a moment now, just to really tune in. We're gonna call in our teams of angels and archangels, our guides, our spirit guides, our light beings, the star people, and calling in the Galactic Council of Light, who channeled this meditation for us this evening as an offering, as a gift for this full moon. So feel that light, visualize, visualize it pouring down through your body as you breathe. So as Annabelle and I call in the energy, I'm just beaming it out to you now. And you could just take a moment now to offer up permission for that energy to be received. In your own words, or just simply saying, I open myself now and give permission to Sarah and Annabelle, their teams of light beings to send this healing to me now for it to be received for my highest good. And keeping that flow of energy, that openness to receive and be bathed in this healing light. So becoming aware now of your seven bodily chakras. You have one at the base of your spine, Muladhara. You have one just below the navel, Savastan. You have one at your solar plexus, just where the ribs meet, Manipura, your heart, Anahata. You have one at your throat, Vishuddha, your third eye, right between the eyebrows at the center of your forehead, Aishna. And you have one at the crown of your head, Sahasara. I want you to imagine that within each of these energy centers, within each of these seven chakras, within your body, there is a crystal. And this crystal could be any shape. Don't overthink this. Just allow any shape to come to your base, your Muladhara. Feel and imagine, visualize a crystal at Savastana just below the navel. Visualize a crystal within your body at Manipura, just where your ribs meet. At Anahata, at your heart. At Bashuda, see a crystal inside your throat. And then see a crystal inside your skull at Ajna and just above your head at Sahasara. Take a moment now to really visualize these. They may be raw, random shapes, or they may be geometrical, squares, spheres, pyramids, diamonds. They might be hexagonal, tetrahedrons. Just imagine shapes, let them come, any visions, any intuition that you feel 
as you place these crystals inside your body. Imagine that each of these crystals is turning inside your body in a clockwise direction, around and around. And that each one is not only a crystal, but it is illuminated. And inside you, it's radiating out light. You feel that these spinning crystals inside you are sending out rays of light into the whole of your body and then out beyond your body so that you are becoming illuminated. And imagine that this light is pure white crystalline energy. You are becoming, as this light radiates out, you're becoming an orb of light yourself within you and all around you. Imagine now that these rays of light coming out of your body are also starting to move around you in a clockwise direction until there is a spiraling of light around your whole body. And just allow your imagination to create these circles of crystalline light around your body. Imagine these spirals, these circles of light are making you a crystalline grid. You are becoming a crystalline grid of light energy. Now imagine that these light energies, this spiraling light energy is tuning in and connecting now to other chakras around your body. You have 12 at least, you don't need to know or think of exactly where they are. But as you visualize this light, just notice that in certain areas it strengthens and there is another energy center out beyond your body, perhaps below your feet, perhaps above your head, perhaps way out in front of your heart or your base behind you and to the sides. Just enjoy creating this crystalline grid around you now. We are activating all 12 chakras, many of them very new to human energies being given to us, gifted to us, helping us to be activated and upgraded to the new higher frequencies that are arriving on our planet now. So Annabelle and I are again just gonna take a pause as we help these 12 chakras, this grid of energy around you to become activated. We're now going to take our awareness out of our bodies. Going on a journey far out beyond the earth, imagine 
that you have floated and drifted and you're now looking down at our planet, this beautiful Earth. Begin to imagine a grid of light surrounding the planet. So looking down from above, see this grid. This planetary grid has existed for eons and it anchors in at sacred sites around the world. It's activated not only from the light beings above us, the star people, the light people and the councils, the divine angelic realms. It's also activated from the earth and we can activate this grid ourselves, us. Let's join this grid now. Seeing the world from above, see a network of light all around the world. Imagine this light at sacred sites all over the planet on every continent. You don't need to know exactly where these sites are. But if you are aware of sacred sites, if you visited them, if you feel connected to any around the world, imagine this light into them all around the world, north, south, east and west. Now imagine that as the, at these sacred sites, this web, this grid, not only moves into the surface of the earth but down through the surface of the earth moving down down through the earth into the crystalline core accessing the inner underworlds as it moves down through the earth as it moves down it calls upon the under beings the crystal beings, calling on them to also rise up and awaken. The light moves down through the earth to the crystal core, also now calling upon the dragon energies to rise up and to awaken, calling on the dragon energies, calling on the under people, calling on the crystalline beings. And we call on the dragons to begin to breathe their fire as they are reawakened to join us in making this grid. Feel now that these under energies are coming back up to the surface of the earth like molten rock as it comes up and then erupts out as a volcano. Imagine now that the activated light from the earth is coming up and pouring out, erupting out onto our planet now, back into the surface of the earth. Light like a volcano erupting through, bringing its crystal energy, its dragon energy with it, back to the surface of our planet. Imagine now our grid of light erupting and pouring with light energy. See again this grid of light around the earth. Now with fiery light energy emerging all over the planet. Feel yourself now, once again, you illuminated, full of light. Feel that you are now connected to all that has risen from below. And feel the light pouring down from above, from the heavens bringing with it new codes, new information, new wisdom, activation, celebration and awakening. 
See again this crystalline planetary grid. Feel yourself within. Feel yourself as a part. And imagine once again, all the light beings and warriors around the planet, our tribe, our collective, this grid of light. Imagine all the human beings who are working with light energy, working to activate this energy grid. just as you are now. The light warriors, the grid workers, the healers and the peace wagers. See us all like beacons, like pillars of light, anchoring in this grid. This crystalline planetary grid is bringing us the great healing. The great remembering. The great awakening. We are the an anchors. We are the activators. from above and from below. We create this web of light. Now the dark energies that have rained on our planet for eons are soon to be released from our energy field. Our dimensional space is to become much higher in its vibration, much higher in its frequency. And all dark forces of manipulation and control, all use of fear and terror, all caging and enslaving of human beings, all creation of scarcity, austerity, pain and suffering will no longer be able to coexist within this crystalline grid of light. So we ask that all is now released, unveiled and released. We ask that we can let go Letting go of all shaming of humanity. Letting go of all abuses of power. Letting go of all acts of war and violence. Letting go of all waging of aggression and control. We ask that all is released now, all blocking of new life enhancing technologies. Allow those blocks to be released. Allow all that stand in the way of love, peace, health, abundance, joy, magic and freedom are released. None can now exist within this planetary grid of light. So Annabelle and I are again going to go silent. Allow these rays of light to be received by you all.
So slowly starting to just bring yourself back a little into your body. Starting to feel your body, whether you're sitting or lying, just start to feel the surface that you're sat or lying on. Maybe start to just wiggle the fingers and toes a little bit. Just gently coming back. And start to take some deeper breaths now. So some long, slow, deep breaths in and out now. And any movements you want to make, any stretching, and then gently come up, coming up to sit. Keep the eyes closed another minute and just bring the hands together at the heart. And just take a moment to feel and have a check in with how you are. And place your hands over your eyes. Just enjoy a few more moments of darkness behind the closed eyes. Anything you can see there on that cheetah, that screen. And then bring the hands down. Namaste.